Hello everybody, it is Dan Lags, and welcome back to a very special video today. Today I'm going to be doing my favorite houses, my top 5 favorite houses countdown here on Minecraft, Xbox 360, and Xbox One. So I did a very similar video to this about a year ago, and I'm going to be kind of be doing a revisited series. So uh, basically, about a year later, lots of new houses have been built, and uh, I'm going to formulate a brand new top 5 houses of mine in terms of my favorite houses. And uh, obviously, the list should be pretty much completely different from a year. There's been a ton of houses have been built. So we're going to go ahead and get started with the countdown. So guys, give it a like if you did enjoy it. Um, this, this video does take a while to make, and I really do enjoy making stuff like this. So uh, if you guys want to support it with a like, that would be great. And let's go ahead and get started with the countdown. Coming in at number five on my top five favorite houses countdown is the Blue Beach House. Now, this house was built in Los Angeles in April of 2014. And my favorite part about this house and why it's number five on our countdown is the lighthouse conversion. So it's kind of like a house connected to a lighthouse right on the edge of the water, which is absolutely my favorite part of it. Um, it's got some great colors. So, um, you know, the kind of that quartz and light blue and cobblestone mixture right with the sand. That's a great combination if you want to build like a beach house like I have. Uh, the one knock on this house that I would say is overall, I'm not a huge fan of the area that I built it in. It's kind of like cramped amongst some houses that really don't match it. Like right across the street, there's a, a snow biome with a log cabin. So, you know, it's like beach house right next to a snow biome doesn't really make a lot of sense, but that's Minecraft. Um, overall, one of my favorite houses. Let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Coming in at number four on my top five favorite houses countdown is the traditional mansion that we just recently finished on Minecraft Xbox One. We did a Let's Build for this. It was finished in October of 2014, so my most recent house. And I like this house. This house instantly, uh, you know, went right into my top five. Um, you know, it's one of the, my favorite houses I've ever made, to be quite honest. You know, it's really structurally sound. Uh, it's got a great landscape to it, great use of sandstone, which can be kind of difficult sometimes in the city texture pack. Uh, but definitely the landscape separates it. I love the, the waterfall in the backyard with kind of the river that runs around the back of the house. Um, the nice big front yard. It's overall a nice looking house. There's really not that many like major flaws in it. It's just really, um, you know, it's not like a really fancy house or anything like that. But it's, uh, you know, it looks nice. And I really do also like the, the, the driveway feature, kind of how it goes underneath the archway. And, you know, it's got the driveways or the garage is kind of connected to uh, the house through that. So... Another part that I really like. So overall, just a really good house and, you know, one we finished really recently. And uh, let's move on. Coming in at number three on my top five favorite houses countdown is the Italian Villa. So I finished building this house for a Let's Build on my channel in July of 2014, which is over the summer. And this is actually my favorite house that I've ever made in the default texture pack, and I have built a ton in the default. Um, overall, I love the theme of this house, that kind of Italian look to it with the, you know, the jungle wood roof and the sandstone. It's just a nice look. It's got all the droopy trees around it, which is, you know, a fan favorite. Um, I really like the way I did the driveway, how it kind of wraps around and, you know, connects to the garage as well as kind of these pathways that run out to the water and then to the backyard. We got a vineyard in the backyard, the interior, the walls are double stacked. So it's got a nice, um, clean interior with the quartz, uh, in the default texture pack. So overall, uh, one of my favorite houses, it's, this one has, uh, been a big favorite of mine since I very first finished it. So I was excited to, uh, add this to the countdown Italian Villa. Let's move on.
Coming in at number two on my top five favorite houses countdown is the Tudor style house remake. Now I finished this house last month in September of 2014. And this, as you guys may know, is a remake of last year's number two on the countdown, which was the Tudor, the original Tudor style house built in Los Angeles. So the remake of it is pretty much the same house with some, you know, updated changes for it um, to the most recent update. This house features a kind of a different garage design. It kind of um, extends out of the left side of the house instead of kind of connected to it. The um, My personal favorite change that I made to it was the front where we have like a nice big driveway connected to the road. Lots of trees have been planted. Um, the interior is pretty much completely different, but I added a nice, uh, you know, theme to it. It's got the logs and stuff like that. So interior is definitely a lot better than it was a year ago. Uh, backyard is also significantly different. We have like a nice pool area, even our own private beach. So this house was one of my favorites from last year's countdown. We rebuilt it. We made it look just as good as it was, if not better. And it comes in at number two on this countdown. So guys, the Tudor style house remake. And last, but most certainly not least, number one on the countdown is, well, what everybody guessed, the Alpine Mansion. So, uh, obviously, this is my favorite house that I've ever made. You know, I can't really say much about it. You know, uh, you know, done lots of videos on it before. I'm sure many of you guys have already seen it. So, it doesn't really need words to explain it. Just going to kind of fly around it, see how it looks. Guys, the Alpine Mansion. All right, thank you very much, guys, for watching my top five favorite houses countdown. I'll do another one of these in about a year, and uh, this is a fun video to make. So, guys, give it a like if you did enjoy it, and I will talk to you guys on the next one. But first, I want you guys to leave in your comments, what is your favorite house of all the houses that I've ever built? Um, I'm just curious to see what you guys like. So, with that, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.